Hello everybody, welcome back to another video with Electra Soul. If you're new to my channel, I'm a psychic medium, a spiritual coach, and just that spiritual bitch trying to put everybody on. What I intend to do is to teach people that God and Jesus and spirituality coexist as one. Now this video is going to be about how you can cancel out your bad luck. I put quotation marks for a reason, I'm gonna get into that. Many, 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 many people have been telling me I have such bad luck in my life, things never go right for me, why do I always suffer so much? Now I'm gonna tell you how you can cancel cancel out the fact that you have horrible luck that things never go right for you because obviously that is not the life that you were intending to live it is actually a lot easier than you think because it does involve the law of assumption something that i often talk about on my channel and as y'all know all the law of assumption things that i know are based off of sammy ingram y'all should go check her out if you haven't before she has changed my life and she can definitely change yours too i'm wearing my beloved 333 angel number hoop earrings which i will have linked down below i will also be having my spiritual readings my spiritual services linked down below as well as my spiritual store so that you can go cop i will also be having my social medias linked down below so y'all can go check that out if you'd like all right y'all so as we all know bad luck is basically when a continuous string of bad things happen to us and we feel like we can't get away from it because it just won't stop now this is the opposite of good luck which is when a lot of good things happen to you all the time because you know you're probably just that bitch but the reason you're that bitch is because you believe that good things can happen to you so this is a very important point within getting rid of your bad luck is that it starts with you something that i always say is that the only person who has more control over your life is nobody because it's you you are the one who's going to make everything happen for yourself whether that be a positive or a negative thing i know it sounds crazy but bad luck is actually a belief if you believe consistently that you will receive bad luck for doing something or just that a whole bunch of bad things happen to you that is exactly what's going to happen to you i remember when i was in first grade there was a girl in my class that had a little pencil eraser and she told me it was her lucky pencil eraser because every time she had it she would score good on tests I remember I asked her how she made it lucky and she told me that it just became lucky. Well, it wasn't advertised at the store as a good luck eraser, was it? No. She intended that it would bring her good luck and that is exactly what it did. Every single time she had that little pencil eraser on her pencil and she would take her test, she would score an A because she believed that for herself. I remember I wanted the same thing for myself so I was like, okay, bet. I grabbed my paper clip and I held it in my hand and I was like, this is going to bring me so much good luck. Every time I have it, good things are going to happen to me. I remember I only had the paper clip for about two days and I stopped putting like my intentions into it because I remember knowing that I didn't want outer things to have control over me because I knew that if I had a paper clip and I believed that it was good luck that I would have to bring that paper clip with me everywhere in order for good things to happen to me. So the first thing that you're going to do here is you're going to stop giving bad luck control over your life, okay? Bad things do not happen to you because you're a shitty person unless you actually are and you just have a bunch of karma but that's not what we're talking about here. We're talking about good people with bad things that happen to them stop expecting bad things to happen to you because the more that you expect these bad things to happen to you i promise you life will hit you with them life will not hesitate with showing you exactly what you deserve because if you're saying that that's what's going to happen to you the universe is just going to take it as okay this person believes that this is what should happen to them so this is exactly what's going to happen to them the moment that you give control to things outside of yourself is the moment that you screwed up i'm sorry if i hurt your feelings but it is the truth you are the only one who can control the things that happen to you so why would you expect for bad things to happen to you just because you've experienced bad things before that doesn't mean that it's destined for you it just means that you expect that to happen and that life is just going to match your energy the moment that you begin to believe that nothing bad can happen to you that only good things that things always work out in your favor and that you expect great things to happen all the time babe is the moment that great things are going to start happening for you stop thinking that seeing a black cat is bad luck stop thinking that breaking a mirror is seven years of bad luck stop thinking that stepping on a crack is gonna break your mother's back like bitch nothing gonna happen to your mother unless you say that something's gonna happen to her if you have a good luck charm and you really feel like that is what's going to bring you good luck you know go ahead and bring it with you but do not let that thing control your life don't make it a thing where oh if i lose my good luck charm a whole bunch of bad shit's gonna happen to me because that's simply not true there were many times in my life where i had like a good luck charm and the second that i lost it or it broke all i said was it's okay good things still happen to me this good luck charm did not define the good things that happened to me in my life the same thing goes with the bad luck do not give bad luck control over your life because the second that you start 
start thinking mm, maybe it's bad luck maybe bad things will happen to me if i do it bro that's literally the moment that you can start to expect for bad things to happen to you if something does end up going wrong you can affirm that the end result turns out to be really positive it's all about the way you receive perceive things it's just very important that you believe that you deserve good things and that is exactly what's going to happen to you you all deserve really great things and i really affirm that all the time that good things always happen to y'all because y'all deserve it and y'all need to know that for yourselves as well all right y'all that's basically it for my video thank y'all so much for watching i really appreciate it it is just so important that y'all realize that all the bad things that happen to you yeah they're bad things but the way that you react and the things that you say about the bad things that happen to you is extremely important because that is what's going to decipher what kind of other things are going to happen to you in your life we all want good things everybody does at a soul level even if our ego tells us that we don't it's fucking cat bitch we all want good things it is extremely important that you take back control of your life and you stop screwing yourself over because you're afraid there is nothing to be afraid of except for your own mind which is why it's so important that you affirm your positive outcomes that you stop letting bad luck do things to you because babe you don't have bad luck unless you claim that you do that's just the way it is honestly all right i'll see y'all this sunday for another video thank y'all again so much i really appreciate y'all god bless y'all take care everybody please no more bad luck bye bad luck the only bad luck that you have is you cursing yourself on accident by saying the shit that you're saying stop talking about you have bad luck you have amazing luck for as long as you claim that you do and scene